The fastest way to lower your handicap and your scores and also to elevate your enjoyment is to work on your putting. Just, just think, you've hit yourself a great tee shot, you hit a second shot on the green, you're faced with a 30-foot putt, and you're three or four foot, and you're three or four putt from there. So let's spend a couple minutes here talking about how to become a good putter. And I believe that there's four steps to good putting. Now, this takes place after you read the green, after you make your practice swings, but there's four steps to a consistent stroke. First of all, look at the, your putter handle. You'll take note that the, the handle's flat on top. Unlike the full swing handle, which is round, so your putting grips can be a little bit different here. So step number one is to place your, your lower hand on the club. Now, I'm a right-handed golfer. I put my right hand down there first. So I put my hand on the club first, thumb on top. Now, you want to create an angle in the back of your lower wrist. So I walk in there, aim the putter. I create an angle in the back of my wrist. Step two is to get my body lined up. You want your stance relatively narrow. Ball a couple inches aside your left heel. Get your eyes over the golf ball. So again, I still maintain the angle back of my right wrist. Step three, I slide my top hand on the club. So my top hand's on the club, my thumb's on top, and my lead wrist is still flat. And step number four, I make an arm swing, and I maintain the angles in my hands. So again, I make an arm swing, I maintain the angles in my hands. And that allows me to control my distance when you putt. You don't want to play volleyball when you putt. When I talk about that, you just hit it far, hit it short, hit it far. You want to maintain the distance when you putt. And that's all the effect of maintaining your angles as you swing, angles in the wrist. So again, four steps. Put my lower hand on first, set the angle of my wrist, get my body set, top hand on the club, I'll make an arm swing, and I'll maintain the angles in my wrist as the ball goes in the hole. So again, for more tips, log on to TroonGolfAcademy.com.